Moat Marine Lab is remembering senior scientist Dr. John Reynolds, who passed away December 23rd. SNN's Samantha Sonner has more on his research and the impact he had. Conservation and education were the driving forces of Dr. John Reynolds' work. Trying to protect uh, species to make sure that they didn't go extinct, to do all that we could to help implement policy that made sense, not only for the animals, but for people. Dr. Reynolds led Moat's Manatee Research Program, was appointed by three presidents to lead the U.S. Marine Mammal Commission, and with the help of his team, completed more aerial surveys of manatees than any other group of scientists in the world. It was John's charm that made it all happen, and everyone looked at John for guidance and advice. I don't think I met a single person that didn't like John. Longtime research partner and friend, Dr. Dana Wetzel, traveled with John to study animals from the Arctic to the Caribbean. He was as kind a person as you will ever come across. He was a gentleman. He was, uh, I don't know that I ever saw him angry, frustrated, yes. Angry, no. She says he was smart, goofy, and a self-described technological dinosaur. When it came to doing something like developing an Excel graph, he absolutely would throw his hands up and just, you know, he had no idea exactly how to <laughs> that happened. Dr. Wetzel says Reynolds always tried to inspire new generations of scientists. He always had time for anyone um, if they wanted to come and talk about their careers in science or education in science. Dr. Wetzel says his legacy will live on in those he inspired. There's just so many people he touched and in a good way. Um, we all need to reach out and do the things that John did. Reporting in Sarasota, I'm Samantha Sonner, SNN, the Suncoast News Network.